If you are a collector of dice, you need to see these dice. Some of the most uniquely shaped dice is what Polyhero brings to the table, and they are super cool. They started their creative pursuit of imaginative dice creations in 2015 with a Kickstarter to produce the Warrior set. The quest to create the Warrior set was a big success, and now they turn their eyes towards the horizon, with an eye on expanding the range of dice to include all kinds of wonderful designs, celebrating their passion for tabletop gaming, and cool and unusual dice. The set of the dice I have here from them today for you and that I will be giving away are the wizard dice, which are the main set that they started on their Kickstarter. Each seven piece set of wizard dice consists of a d4 ball, a d6 fireball, a d8 scroll, two d10 potions, a d12 wand, and a d20 orb. They currently have 10 different colors, heartwood, lapis lazuli, ethereal ice, dragon fire, violet storm, wizard stone, pink elixir, green flame, and the two I have here today are the shadow with demon's eye, and I'm giving away a set of parchment. The dice are gorgeously colored with the fact that the number are hand inked, they're vibrant, and none of the color mixtures are too hard to see or make out while you're playing since they're opaque. They're also molded fairly well. I did notice there were a few rougher edges on one of these dice, but with how uniquely designed they are, there's no problems with it because the mold lines are placed pretty smartly. These dice are pretty unusually shaped. They roll differently, look different in general, and are gorgeous while doing so. For a trading card game player, they're pretty nifty, but less used. But for tabletop gamers like D&D and board games, these are a dream to use. As a trading card game player, I found that most of the use was of course in the d20, the d4 bolt, and the d6 fire bolts. They're super handy and I reach for them constantly. The edges of these dice, like I said, are fairly good as well as because they have so much detail, it's like they have a ledge to sit on so you, if you accidentally bump them, they don't go rolling everywhere as to the dice like Chessex would. And they're fairly heavy, which is nice. They don't feel too light either, they're a good medium weight dice. With the roll tests, they were perfectly fine, no inconsistency issues, but I'm pretty bad at rolling dice so who knows. If you're a collector of dice, I would 100% recommend you pick up a set of these. I've never seen dice like how unique they are and I have a lot of different dice, believe me, I do. I would recommend these to most people for RPGs. Overall, I would probably rate these about a 7 out of 10. The design is gorgeous and they're super collectible. Two of the dice for me were harder to use because I like to keep track of numbers, but I don't use a lot of dice like them anyway. If I had to pick up only two or three of the dice and not a whole set, I would definitely grab the D6 fireballs, the bolts, and the D20s. I could live without the others play-wise, but collecting-wise, I am dying for these dice. I I love these. I am super happy that I have a set of these in my collection and I'm super happy that I have a set to give away. Honestly, you guys, if you are a collector of dice, you 100% need a set of these. I can guarantee, almost guarantee I should say, that you probably don't have a set exactly like these. So if you are interested in grabbing up a set of these dice, I am doing a giveaway. All you have to do is be subscribed to this YouTube channel and like this video. A link to submit your entries will be in the description and once the giveaway is over, if you've won, all you have to do is reply to my email and we're good and golden. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Working with Polyhero was awesome and they have some amazing dice. Honestly, 10 out of 10. Like, the dice themselves are 7 out of 10, but working with the company and how easy it was to talk to everyone, I'd give this whole experience a 10 out of 10. So I hope you guys like this video video and I hope to talk to you guys again really soon.